So I already got an update to this, the shooting of Jesus Lozano, 51-year-old Jesus Lozano, has been allegedly shot and killed by Rondell Brown, 25-year-old Rondell Brown. And one piece of information, I heard that Jesus Lozano had got shot, they keep saying 900 Wilking Way, I think it's right over there by Fort Garland, Sangre de Cristo Ranches, subdivisions. But he actually didn't own it. Jesus Lozano didn't own the property, didn't own the house. So I don't know if it's his own home. It was owned by his fiance. Now I'm thinking, is it his fiance? How long had they been dating? And, you know, now I'm asking some more questions. So Rondell Brown also, the other update is uh, I found two Facebook pages for him. One is here that doesn't have any pictures, but it's got some information. Apparently he had started it back in 2018, maintenance worker at the Valley Irrigation of Greeley. Uh, Greeley, Greeley. And then it has uh, some of his friends here. It's got Rena Berrigan, Johnny Shields, John Patterson, Tommy Willis, Jeremy Borden, Michael Ellis, Joel Sletton, Todd Willis, Stevie O. Massey, uh, Alejandro Cryer, Christopher York, Jeremy Borden, Michael Ellis, Tessa Beck, Ty Davis, Zach Weedman. Just to throw out some of his Facebook friends, which may or may not mean, may mean something, may mean everything, probably means nothing. But here's another one where you get some pictures, you get a sense of who this guy actually is. So let's see here. He likes Little Dirk, the block list. I don't know. He went to Greeley Central High School. Went to Lompac Senior High. Lives in Denver, Colorado. He's from Lompac, California. So that's interesting. So is he a Greeley man or a California man? Seems like he probably came from California. He updated his cover photo to say, Hi, hoy, minoy, which I'm not for sure. Smile, there's weed at home. Okay, so Rondell Brown, let's just look at some of these pictures. All right, that's that's the one that's on the his cover. That's the main one or whatever. Here's another one. And these are all going to be in, you know, better days. And I guess that's it. So there's a couple pictures there to give you a sense of... Oh, here's another one. And here's another one. So a whole bunch of pictures, right? You all getting a sense of... And there's like four more here. Alright. So, there you go. And this one, this is a new account. And it has none of his, you know, friends listed. So all the friends are hidden from the world. Be the reason someone believes in good people. He had posted repression. Stop trying to be so strong. Do you know what happens when you keep holding it all together? 
you eventually fall apart, da 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 some other stuff. So there you go. That's a little bit of an update. Uh, R.I.P. R.I.P. to Jesus Lozano. They said apparently he's an acquaintance of the Lozano family. He was arrested on Friday, and that was after a week-long investigation. The CBI had issued a warrant. 25-year-old Rondell Brown was arrested in Greeley, Weld County Jail. He's in Weld County Jail now in a $150,000 bond, charged with second-degree murder and three counts of felony menacing. 